What to do while waiting for a spouse? You prepare. You don't sit here and dwell. We have too many women and men that are dwelling on spouses right now. And you are neglecting who God needs you to be in this season. You start preparing now. Yes, you pray for that spouse. Don't be praying that he's coming in and don't be praying that you're gonna meet him everywhere you go. You pray for him or her that they are who God needs them to be. So that by the time that they get to you, you don't got a whole mess to clean up with them. They're already ready. They're already obedient to God. And so you pray for them that they're being obedient to the Lord. You pray that they're living a repentant life. You pray for that future marriage, that it is going to last until the return of Jesus. And you make sure that you are being the man of God that God needs you to be or the woman of God that God needs you to be. If you are a woman of God, then you study Proverbs 31. What did that woman do? Who was she? What did she do for her family? Because listen, Proverbs 31 women are not just chucked out the window. That is still very much a necessity in every single marriage today for you to do all of those things. They might look a little different. Listen, I don't make my husband's clothes. I'm going to buy him clothes, but do I need to know how to sew? Absolutely. So that way I can sew if he rips his pants or rips his shirt. I'm able to sew the button back onto it. But these are things that we have neglected because we've gotten so like, well, I'll just go buy new. God doesn't tell us to just go buy new all the time. Sometimes, you know, we serve such a restorative God. God is a God of restoration. So why would we just throw everything away every single time? So you get in the word, you read that Proverbs 31 woman on what God expected of her because they are still very much expectations of you today. And so you're preparing, prepare to be the spouse that God needs you to be. Prepare, 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 and stop dwelling.